If you're reading this post, it's probably because you recently found out you're pregnant, so congrats! One of the most important moments during your pregnancy is hearing your baby's heartbeat for the first time. For many women, this is when the thought of being a mother really kicks in and they realize the miracle of life. In this video, I want to outline what to expect during these times and especially regarding your baby's heart. I'm Dr. Carolina Melgar from Solo Health. During the fifth week, your baby's cardiac cells have started to organize to form the heart. They should have a steady heartbeat and maybe the size of a length beam. Around the sixth week, the heart will start pumping blood. If you're actively trying to conceive, you may have taken a pregnancy test and already know you're expecting. Sometimes your doctor may be able to see the gestational sac in the fourth or fifth week. It's like a little ring inside of a round black pouch and it's usually smaller than a pea. However, you won't be able to detect a heartbeat yet. Although your baby's heart is developed enough to start beating around the fifth or sixth week, it will probably take a bit longer to hear. An ultrasound around eight weeks may be able to detect an audible heartbeat. If you have an early ultrasound exam, your doctor may be able to see a heartbeat but not hear it. Because your baby's heart is too small at this time, it doesn't make enough sound waves for the beat to be audible. Some doctors prefer to wait a few weeks until after the first trimester to do the ultrasound. However, he might recommend it if you have a high-risk pregnancy. During your regular pregnancy checkups, you'll also get to hear the heartbeat when the doctor uses a fetal Doppler. This device can pick up the heartbeat starting around 10 weeks, however, many women need to wait until 12. Some mothers worry if they don't hear a heartbeat with the first ultrasound. That's why doctors prefer to wait a few, a few weeks. If your doctor uses a fetal Doppler at 10 weeks to pick up a heartbeat and it's not audible, don't worry, you may need to wait an extra couple of weeks for your baby to develop enough or to move into a better position. So your doctor will tell you when you should come back to check. Always tell your doctor if you feel any symptoms that call your attention, especially vaginal bleeding, which may be followed by cramping and pain in your lower abdomen. The first time you hear your baby's heartbeat will probably be during an ultrasound exam. I bet you didn't know you could use a Doppler at home. If you're a worrier like me or had miscarriages before, hearing your baby's heartbeat can give you the reassurance that your baby's okay. It can also be a bonding activity for the entire family. I recommend that you first try it around 12 weeks. It's true, you can hear a heartbeat early as 8 or 10 weeks. However, it's more likely that you won't be able to find it and this can cause unnecessary anxiety. I always thought it sounded like galloping horses. If you want, you can click here to listen to a fetal Doppler I did the other day. Fetal Dopplers are easy to use. Simply lie down, spread some ultrasound gel on your lower belly and turn the probe on. Glide the probe in a rocking motion until you detect a heartbeat. If you can't detect a heartbeat at 12 weeks or earlier, it could be too early. If you've previously detected a heartbeat and can't seem to find it now, <clears throat> don't worry. Your baby could simply be in a different position. So take a break and try again in a few hours or the next day. Sometimes it's easier if you have a full bladder or when you first wake up in the morning. The bigger your baby gets, the easier it should be to hear the heartbeat. There are a few noises that can be mistaken for a heartbeat that can interrupt what you're hearing. For example, you can feel your own heartbeat or di digestive processes and the baby's movements too. Remember that your heartbeat is normally from 60 to 100 beats per minute. So if the monitor displays that heart rate, it's very likely that it's picking up on your own arteries. So remember that the fetal Dopplers can't diagnose medical problems and they don't replace checkups. So if you think you detect an irregularity, you can record the sound and have your doctor listen. So tell me, have you heard your baby's heartbeat yet? Let me know in the comments below. So if you like the video, follow and subscribe.